first and foremost, you know, I just want to talk to you about, you know, your first day out here. You don't have Ryan Nassib in front of you anymore. It's an open competition. Yeah. So just talk to me about that. Well, it's good because we're um, everybody's competing. You know, we don't we don't you know have to sit out any reps because Ryan was taking them all. You know, because he was the starter. So now it's like all depending on you is just spot to lose. And as far as, you know, how you played out there today, just, you know, bring me into it. I mean, you didn't have pads on, but how do you feel your throws were today? I feel like they could have been better, you know, first day jitters and everything, but it is, I'm going to progress as the week goes on. As far as your comfort level with the receivers that are out there, you know, who did you really feel like you connected with out there? Jared West and um, Chris Clark. So good, real good about that. And what was it about them that you felt so comfortable as opposed to some of the other guys? Well, they were experienced and we were always throwing like after practice or, you know, before practice, just, just to keep working on it. So I felt real comfortable with them. Being on the sideline, waiting for your turn, now having an opportunity to just go out there and get it, just bring me into that, you know, looking forward to the fact that you have an opportunity now. Yeah. Well, it felt real good because, you know, sitting on the sideline is the worst. So being able to actually get an opportunity and make the best of it is the best thing to happen. And talk to me about Coach Schaefer. I mean, he was on the defensive side when you were here last year, and, you know, now he's your head coach. What has he said to you? You know, what's really lasted with you as far as moving forward now? Well, the first thing he said to me was, I want a quarterback that's going to compete, you know, so that's the first thing that stood out to me because who doesn't want a quarterback that's going to compete? And he said that. I like him a lot because he's real enthusiastic. He wants a good leader, so you know, it's going to be a good season. Talk with me about Coach Lester and what he's, you know, taught you coming in here so early on in, in his career, but kind of working with you in, in this new situation. Well, he's a great coach. He knows a whole bunch of, you know, tricks just to get the ball out quicker and everything, so... I'm really interested in working with him and happy that we have, actually have a quarterback coach instead of an offensive coordinator that was a quarterback coach. And lastly, Coach McDonald, very passionate guy out there. Just go into you know, what practice was like with him out there and what he was trying to tell you to help you out. Yeah, he's, he's, a tough as, he's as tough as nails. So, you know, he's definitely going to be hard. He's going to get under your skin a lot. So you just got to be tough out there and just listen to what he says and he'll never lead you wrong. Thanks, Terrell.